hey welcome back to the channel today's video we're reviewing these three baby lotions can you tell i'm laying down <laughs> stay tuned all right so fresh out the bath and you can see the dry skin he has dry skin and on his legs too hey 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 not so much but i'm gonna flip you I'm going to flip you. Flip, 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 flip. <laughs> okay. And you see this? Ah, you see the <laughs> patches on his back. And then also in the creases of his little fat rolls. You got it? You got it? Okay. Come back over. Come back. No. <laughs> okay. So, sorry if you saw all that extraness. But let's get painting real close. It's just dry. Okay, so when I dry him off, I do not wipe. You just pat. And this is solely for me patting. I really hope you're able to see this. Turn some more. So, and he's really dry and flaky. So, um, this first one, that's the, the you can read, the Shea Moisture. 100% virgin coconut oil with sweet pea and maru. Muru, Muru. Okay. Um, this, I really feel like this lotion did this. Because he was not like this when I was using just the Honest brand. So this is the Honest Face and Body Lotion. Um, and the Sweet Almond Scent. So, and obviously you guys know Shea Moisture. They always say they don't have parabens, no, no phthalates, no mineral oil, no sulfates, and no animal testing. But I think the coconut oil does it for him. And I think it was like that with my other children. So I will show you. It's pretty thick. The only thing I really love about this is it's really thick. It's thick. But then it look, doesn't look so thick. But um, it is. It's pretty, it's pretty thick and pretty... Um, I should have done this one last. Anyway, it's pretty thick. I'm going I'm to go wash my hands. It's pretty thick and it smells really good. It smells so good. I just don't think it's for his skin. I think his skin does not like it. Point blank period. And he's looking at me like I'm crazy. But um, yeah, I'm going to go wash my hands and then show you guys the rest. I should have done this one last, but um, I did wash my hands. The fragrance is still there, but at least the residual... Um, lotion is off so I really like this for I'll just use it for myself but as far as putting it on him I'm not because I feel like he was fine and then <laughs> he was fine and then he just started breaking out with this so this is a no-go for me and I think this was what ten dollars so and, and most to be honest most Shea Moisture baby products the smell is too strong it's way too strong. It's overpowering. This does smell good, like I said, but it's just, it lingers and it lasts for days. Um, does this have fragrance in it? Yes, but it's all essential oil blends, if you can see right there. Uh, fragrance, essential oil blend. But um, yeah, okay, next. So, these two, they both, I both, I got all three from Target. This the next one. Let's do let's do this one because I feel like after he broke out and got all of the the eczema and stuff that you probably can't see anymore because I have moved the camera. Um, this did nothing and it's so thin. It's so thin. Okay, it's really thin. Yeah, it's really thin, and I feel like. I'm not pulling you. So if I get you in closer and I really okay, yeah, oh yeah, don't turn. See, it's just dry. And I felt like this lotion, while it's good, did not do any justice. Did not do anything for us as far as be keeping moisturized. 
and uh, moisturize for 24 hours no does not sure it's naturally derived from um you know ingredients um it has a nice smell my husband doesn't like the smell but it has a nice smell okay so the claim for this one for it being moisturizer for 24 hours that's a lie that's a no though the last one is cloud island and this is for sensitive care come on it says sensitive care fragrance free lotion made without phthalates or parabens I'm just now noticing this. USDA organic. Okay. So basically, all the ingredients should be organic. Um, now, this does say non-greasy. It's, um, what's this one? Yeah, fragrance-free. It does not have a scent. But, it does. It kind of smells like, do, 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 do. what is in here? I think it's Shea. Shea. It, there's not a bad scent and it's not an overpowering scent and it's not an overpowering scent like these two okay but actually i'm sorry like the shea moisture it's not an overpowering scent but it, it's a nice scent but it's not, it's fragrance free as in there's no added fragrance basically now this one while it is thin and i am going to put this is the one i'm going to use on him because i feel like this helped with this and he he just like I said he just got out of the bath. The, today is Wednesday. The last time he had a bath was Saturday. That was really my fault. He should have had a bath yesterday. So in between baths, while I'm talking to you guys, I'm a, we're on the bed, and I'm gonna basically, sorry, I'm gonna basically put this on him. But it's <clears throat> what in between baths I do, um, and that's how thick it is. I feel like it's a creamy consistency but it's thicker than the honest but thinner than the shea moisture it's kind of in the middle but it, i don't know but i like it i wish it was a little thicker little hands. i wish it was a little thicker but um i like it as far as it's kept him moisturized and it's not i don't think it's claiming to do that for a certain period of time. But I do like this because I feel like the first time, and I forgot about this lotion. So the first time I put it on him, after um, you <laughs> coming to my senses and saying, oh, the honest is not working. The honest is, why are you still using this on him? It's, it's not whatever, it's not doing anything. And as you, if you can see, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move your hands. I'm gonna come in closer. He looks moisturized. Okay. As far as the honest one, he, it would be like that for maybe a good hour. Look, look, look. We're not showing your goods. Okay. Yeah, these diapers, that's a whole nother, nother situation. But, um, yeah, I like this better and I feel like it keeps him moisturized for longer. Maybe not, um, and that's too much. <laughs> I'm talking to y'all. Um. I'm going to put some on myself because that's too much lotion. I like this one better and I feel that, like I said before, it's better than the Honest. And it's, it's probably on level with the Shea Moisture. Now, only reason why I have an issue with Shea Moisture, once again, is because probably that coconut oil. <laughs> and I think that coconut oil did it. And I hope y'all couldn't hear the um, AC. But the coconut oil... Something and coconut oil in my kid's skin. No, it's another. Is that right? Isn't that right? Coconut oil in you all skin is another. Okay, so I'm gonna flip him over. I'm gonna zoom in and flip flip you over. Come on, come on. And I forgot to do this on. Come on. There you go. Okay, so we we looking at the the eczema. Okay, and if we go a little close, there we go. You can see, you can see. And then I'm gonna show you after I put the. I'm gonna show you after I put the lotion on. He is just messing up the blanket. I don't know if you. So I'm putting that much on. That's probably too much. I don't know if you guys want to see this side or not. Give him a little massage. 
And typically, I put this on before his diaper, but, you know, for video purposes. Hey, hey, hey. And I used to put the Honest um, in his hair, but I stopped doing that because I just felt like that wasn't working. This is a birthmark, that redness that you see right there. Can I flip you over again? God, I did your legs. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. Okay, real quick. You can see he's nice and he's nice and a little shiny and nice and moisturized. Okay, you get an answer. You want to roll over? You want to move over? Okay, all right. And then last but not least, I, um, yeah, we're going to do your face. Just a little bit. And that's, once again, probably a little too much. And on his face, I feel like don't forget the ears <laughs> and his nose and your nose is dirty. So his cheeks are the worst. Come back this way. So his cheeks are the worst. And um, hi. Today isn't a, a good day, but can you see? The, turn over no okay typically it's worse right here <laughs> but um today he's looking good so basically come this way okay let's wrap this up okay so that is in for this and you happy yeah someone's teething i do believe that's why he keeps doing that but let's so basically out of the three Scoot that over next to you, huh? Out of the three. It's it's in it's it's in the order that I like. Um, this is the favorite. Hey, hey, hey. This is the favorite. This is the second. It's okay. This is my least favorite just because it breaks him out. But I would use this on myself. So let's take that out of there. Let's let's take that out. So out of the two of these, Cloud Islands first, then honest. Now, what are you doing? You're so happy, but um, I don't dislike the honest one. I just think it could do a little more. And I know his shirt says hi. It should say bye because we're leaving. <laughs> but I really hope this helps someone because when I was looking for, I haven't had a baby since my young, my, my middle now. He's 10. So I just knew I wasn't using Johnson & Johnson products. But um, I really hope this helps somebody. Even a tiny bit just to be like, okay, I'll use that. And like I said, all three have great ingredients. Just all three will work differently for different babies, different people, different strokes for different folks. My stroke, Cloud Island, Honest, I like that, but not on a baby. So if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe and you'll see more from us. Oh, you smiling? You say hi to the people? <laughs> <laughs> um, and we'll catch you in the next one guys bye